USA Hockey is pretty successful at the under-17 level, under-18, the World Junior Championship, women's hockey, sledge hockey, the Olympics, of course. They win or come close to winning consistently. But at the World Hockey Championship, well, let's put it this way. They haven't won a gold medal in color. The last time the USA won gold was in 1960, and that's when the World Hockey Championship was combined with the Winter Olympic Games. It was in Squaw Valley. The last time they won a gold at a standalone World Hockey Championship was in 1933. And since they won that black and white medal, they've won a few in color. Three bronze medals since then. The most recent was in 2004. But still, bronze, of course, isn't gold. And you talk to USA Hockey officials about it, and you get the feeling they are frustrated by their lack of success at the World Championship. You bet they are. Yeah, it is. I mean, I, I, mean, I, I do think we do come in with a high expectation. Uh, every year, same as this year, our guys can't come here expecting to compete for the championship. Now, they've got seven games to create their identity, to put themselves in a position to, to have an opportunity to, to win the championship. And so, you know, from a USA Hockey's perspective, yeah, we absolutely want to have more success consistently at this tournament. So the magic gold medal winning question is, what does it take? Part of it is, in the end, to win these kind of championships, I think you do need uh, a few difference makers that, that in the end win the really tight, close games. And in most cases in this tournament, it comes down to goal, goal scoring and having enough goal scoring to win the tournament because I honestly think everybody defends well. I think everyone's got good goaltending. And to just have that little edge to get over the, the hump, if you will, in this tournament consistently is you need some quality goal scoring and, and that's always been a little bit of a challenge for us at this tournament. But if USA hockey fans are looking for some inspiration, look no further than the man behind the bench this year. He's a believer. The USA didn't win gold in 1996, but they did defeat the Russians in overtime to win the bronze medal. And Joe Sacco was the man who set up Brian Ralston for the winner. We ended up beating Russia in the uh, bronze medal game. I think it was the first medal for the U.S. in a long time. I don't know how many years it was exactly, but it was a long time. And it was a great feeling. And, you know, to this day, it's something that I cherish. You had a lucky assist, didn't you, on the goal? Well, I wouldn't say it was lucky. <laughs> I wouldn't say it was lucky. I would say uh, it was actually a shorthand to play. And Brian Ralston scored the winning goal. It was a great shot. And I actually made uh, one of the few passes that I made in my career over to him for the game winner. So... Don't uh, don't don't put that don't put don't play that too too low for me. That was a highlight of my career. <laughs> hey, who knows? Perhaps another highlight in the making here in Helsinki. Reporting for IIHF.com, I'm Paul Romanuk.